Good afternoon, Mustangs. I'm Krista Baiza. I am Yesenia Perales, and you are watching Mustang Nation News. April is Child Abuse Awareness Month. In honor of the less fortunate children in our community, Student Council will be hosting a baby shower April 27th through May 4th. All donations will go to the Rainbow Room hosted by the Texas Department of Family Protective Services. Please check Schoology for a list of items needed. The Rainbow Room provides supplies and materials for mothers who are in abusive situations and are attempting to start a new life with their children. On April 16th, our Special Olympic athletes competed against other athletes in our surrounding area. Congratulations to all of the competitors. Alyssa Dunlap, 4th place 100 meter dash and 1st place softball throw. Jasmine Trevino, 5th place 100 meter dash and 2nd place softball throw. Carrie Jones, 3rd place 100 meter dash and 2nd place softball throw. Cassie Morin, 2nd place 100 meter dash and 1st place softball throw. Donovan Haynes, 1st place 100 meter dash and 1st place shot put. This past weekend, our FFA members judged the state contests. The Cotton judging team got 47th out of 82 teams and 4th in district. Our Plant ID team did very well and finished 12th at state, 2nd in area, and 1st in district. The members of this team are Keely Holcomb, Reagan Holder, Briley Morris, and Christian Torres. This year was the first to have a milk quality team. Reagan Holder, Sammy Mar Lovelace, Christian Torres, and Maggie Lopez competed and got third in district. Congratulations, FFA. Juniors and National Honor Society need to go to the upstairs gym today during bee lunch. Food will be provided, but you will need a drink. UIL Academics qualified four students to the state meet in May. Congratulations to Radhika Bakta, Jessica Balderrama, Destiny Lopez, and Eric Lopez. Home Hospice is hosting their butterfly release on Sunday, May 1st. If you need hours, please see Ms. Carter. Students, we will begin turning in laptops during English classes in two weeks. Seniors have the option of purchasing their assigned laptop. Remember that all laptops will be re-imaged, so save your files to Google Drive if you want to recover them. This includes seniors' laptops. See the email from Mrs. Hogan for more information and your specific turn-in date. Please participate in the Varsity and JV Cheerleading Little Caesars Pizza Fundraiser. Proceeds will help fund summer camp. All orders must be placed by Friday, April 29th. Use the information below. Volunteers are needed at the Andrews County Library to help with their summer reading program. If you would like to volunteer as a planner, decorator, or worker, please contact the Andrews County Library and ask for Mary Lou Chavez. Seniors, don't forget to pick up a form for Decision Day from Ms. Reed. The forms are due Friday. Seniors, if your senior bio is not turned in by May 2nd, your photo and bio will not be in the graduation edition of the Andrews County News. The Andrews Relay for Life is scheduled for May 20th. The Community Problem Solvers Group, Beyond You, encourages you to sign up to walk or show up your support by purchasing a Heart and Soul t-shirt. All proceeds go to the American Cancer Society. The link to purchase a shirt is in Schoology or your email. Attention all athletes, please check the athletic training equipment owed list on the wall across from the athletic training room in the PC. If you owe equipment, please return it to Mrs. Lloyd or Mr. Champagne. If you do not return it, you will be charged a fine. Attention seniors, today is the last day to complete your CPR requirement. If you do not do this, you will not graduate. NHS students needing community service by the deadline of May 1st, Operation Blessing is having a workday at their building starting at 8 a.m. on Saturday, April 30th. Home Hospice will be hosting their butterfly release on Sunday, May 1st. If you need hours, please see Mrs. Carter. Seniors, please check the counselor's page for local and area scholarship opportunities. UIL academic scholarship applications are due today. The Hispanic Heritage Scholarship, Fallen Hero Scholarship, and Women's Division Scholarship applications are due tomorrow. 
That wraps up today's announcements. I'm Krista Baeza. And I'm Yesenia Perales. Have a thrilling Thursday. And stay gold, Mustangs.